the smokes have been used so far now. And uh, Dupree still has a, an open open space to shoot from. Challenge is being taken here by Device, but he's not going to get that one. Dupree picks up a nice one-on-one. -on -one. There's the second kill, one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, Dupree with one health. What a clutch there from him. Absolutely massive from Dupree. Stealing away that round. Navi had it in the bag, but TSM keep themselves in it. And that, two frags, and that is the bomb. And things look impossible now for Neo. Down to one point of health against Get Right. 25 seconds to play with as well. Neo needs to find the instant one shot, but he's now given away his position as well. Completely to Get Right. Get Right actually missing some shots there. Neo's had some opportunities here to get that one tap. Oh man. And that is exactly what he needed to do. Seriously, Neo. Great. Zeus has been able to find the plant, but he is going to cause Guardian with his own life. So Zeus now holding himself inside of the shed here now. Members of Godsent going to have to push themselves over. Trying to work their way in against Zeus. They haven't spotted him yet, but they're going to go and check it. They're lining right oh. up, though, and Zeus! They're just going to destroy Schneider and Lacro and find a great clutch One. to put Navi into One. a huge lead. <laughs> oh, the <laughs> is on. Okay, never mind. So that, that could be what he needs, unless Showtime just goes for the kill. But no, he's not going to throw it. Will it land in time to do anything to Showtime is the question. Oh, my goodness. I don't think he realizes he's in one HP though, otherwise this incendiary would definitely oh. be getting thrown. And with Showtime with the AWP, it just takes him to land a crazy shot and this, this map is over. Bialy moving his way up to the side, he's going to be checking every corner, Showtime's still looking at short. Surely Bialy's going to have this, he's actually going to throw the incendiary away, Showtime oh beats! And Tempo Storm will pick up the first map! Showtime, the one health dream is real! Oh my goodness, oh, but it will be going down in a three-on-three -three retake coming out from Titan. Yep, here comes Kenny. Uh, around quad side, he's all eyes on pit. Spotted dazed, and now the smoke is going to come out, and hopefully he'll definitely have called that to his teammates, but he is hanging onto a thread. He's only got 29 points of health. Smiths is going to drop AZK with that M4 shot to the face, and now three versus two. You'd really expect Titan to uh, utilize the fact that they were one man up. They still are one man up, thanks to Scream. It's Daze who's hiding in pit. He knows exactly where the bomb has been planted. The defuse is coming in from Scream, and he's holding onto it, and Daze... Oh, the defuse comes in! Oh, and milliseconds. You can see the reaction the from Days. Very mobile weapon. There's the first flick. It's going to uh, whiff there. Second one will connect. The bomb can't be planted. It's 20 seconds to get that down now. Ruben will have seen that, I believe. And he's actually going to go for another angle. This is smart stuff. It's a bit of a gamble as well from Rubino, especially considering that uh, Finesse goes for a safe plant. Rubino, very fast. Will Finesse move into a spot he can abuse? He just sees a pixel there, and oh, what a clutch coming in from Rubino. One HP for the last two frags for the scout. It. Well, Hellraisers are definitely taking their time about it. Really desperately awaiting a peek from Mouseports, but Mouseports are so scared because their health is just ridiculously low. Chris J gets one. He knows who Bondic is. He's got one point of health. What? Chris J and Lowell somehow win that round. That should never happen. He knows that there's a player on B site and he has to fight his way out of it and it's not going to work. It's on Zipnix now. Oh, oh. Gennady's going to catch the bomb. This is unreal. The timing. That is big. One on three for Sip, but he's got the bomb in 40 seconds here. Bialy's already tagged up. Sip there and ready, ready and waiting for him right in front. Can they get the timing down? Pasha's moving up on the other side of him and Sipnik's going to be turning his back and down to one health. Bialy with the patience play coming out. Flashbang is in there now. 25 seconds. Headshot coming in from Sipnix. What could Bialy do? He has to find the bomb and make his way onto a site and look at the angle here. This is not easy. Bialy way out in the open. He gets shot down. Sipnix with the one on three clutch. Oh my god. One health left. What a god. Side of the site. It's too easy for Smith. Lined up with the AWP. Flank coming in. RPK was spotted. Dennis knows this. He has to be careful because one good headshot could do it. Brings it back to the one-on-one. -on -one. And now it's against the AWP. A missed shot's the opportunity. And they don't know that Dennis is on 1 HP because Smith is sticking on the AWP. Thankfully goes to the oh. pistol. Nearly lands it through. The smoke bomb's going to go down. 
And this is still anyone's game, despite that he has one HP. He could clutch this out. Good crosshair placement. Good positioning. Oh. Nearly finds the headshot as well. Smith goes to 47. And back inside of the smoke, Smith. He does get the AWP out. And Dennis has one HP. And he clutches it out. Did he see still Smith? a 2v4. If he just stays alive, he should have run into T-spawn and just waited for that bomb. And that would have been a big issue. But now it's Rain and Michael Lele. 2v4 here. And Michael Lele going to go down eventually. Neo to finish it off and it doesn't look possible here. Rain gets three kills though. And now one bullet left on Patrick gets the quad kill. Are you kidding me? Rain, he picks up every single one and takes it to overtime. That is unreal. One HP. Now, I'm wow. done. I am so done. Exactly right. And he spots out the remaining man as well. So there you go, some initial damage dealt. He does have a kit, but he's down to one HP. He steps out, gets the headshot onto Happy. It's now down to Smith. And he does he realize, he goes to the pistol. Does he realize just how low it is? Happy! And Smiths lose it in the end, and Flavy, just the hero for Na'Vi this tournament. He survives with one HP, and you have to If they that. do this correctly, they can still manage to pull up this retake. Stewie is going to find Wenton first, and I think he just saw Flush as well. He knows he's up there, but no! What? There's going to be a full peak coming out there from Slemmy, and they just leave the angle open for Flusha. Oh. And now Stewie, he's going to essentially run out of time, trying to jump up there, but Flusha could just play with him now. He's going to sit inside, or even throws the pistol out, and it works! Look at this and he guy, finds one the kill. HP! Nicely done by Flusha! Well now, as Astralis have more time to wrap around the alleyway, and there the bomb goes down, you can see that Turns a little bit tax left and right. Zipex making good of the Mag 7. That's the second frag in from him now with that. And a Dren in a 1 versus 3. Can he get it done this time? That bomb ticking away. AK 79 HP. Smoke goes down. There's the first player. Second one from the spray. And there goes the defuse. And he's got to go for the reload. Is Dupree actually sticking it? No, he goes back off of it. And he gets the frag with a mere one single point of health remaining. Dupree will get the defuse and save the day for Astralis and I fear for them what would have happened mentally if they would have lost this round.